pushing on up towards the top end of your mat. Coming up and sitting back upon your heels. Spreading your fingers out nice and wide. And then looking up between your hands. And as you breathe in, let's draw along the ground. Rolling down the shoulders and lifting the chin up. As you breathe out, let's count the toes. Send the hips back, draw your head down through your arms. Breathing in as you draw forwards to a high plank. Breathing out, let's bend the knees and sit back upon your heels. Breathing in as you draw your body up and along the ground. Breathing out, let's send the hips back and draw the head down. Breathing in as we draw forwards to a high plank. Breathing out as bend the knees and sit back. Breathing in to draw the body up and along the ground. Breathing out. Send the hips away and head down through your arms. Breathing in. Come on forwards to high plank. Breathing out. Bending the knees and sitting on back. Breathing in, let's draw the body along the ground. And as you breathe out, let's lengthen away to a nice long down facing dog. Breathing in, draw forwards to high back. Breathing out, bending your knees and sitting in. Breathing in to draw the body up and along the ground. Breathing out, press away and let the head draw down through your arms. Breathing in, draw forwards to high back. Breathing out, let's bend the knees and sitting in back. Breathing in, draw the body up and along the ground. Breathing out, set the hips away and the head down. Breathing in, draw forwards to high back. Breathing out, bend in the knees and sitting in back. One more time, breathing in, drawing the body up and through. And as you breathe out, stay with the downward dog, walking it from one foot to the other. Just working a little through the hips, working a little side to side. As always here, just listening to your body, becoming aware of how the hamstrings, the calf muscles are feeling today, and how your lower back muscles are reacting as you move. And then if we leave the heels back, as far as they'll go at this point, and then walk your hands slowly back in towards your feet. When you get there, let's take a hold of your elbows, and let's just let the body hang on there. Let's just release the shoulders, release the neck. Taking a couple of sighs, deep breath in, sigh out and see if you can hang a little heavier. Again, deep breath in, and sigh, letting it go. Then let it go of your arms, bend your knees on the way up. Slowly unrolling as you get to the top, clasping your fingers together, take a deep breath in. And as you're breathing out, pressing out through the waist, stretching into the side body. Breathing in to breathe back up. Again, breathing out, let's press out into the side body. Thank you. 
hip distance apart, your hands are shoulder distance apart. Now you might want to move your feet in just a little bit closer for the next stretch. I'm going to look to take the right hand beneath the body and hold on to the left, either calf or ankle, it could be the inside or the outside edge of your leg. And then you're looking beneath your left armpit. So you've got a cross back body stretch. Change the hands over, reaching beneath, and then looking beneath your right armpit. And then bring the hand back down to the ground. And let's take a nice big stride through with your right foot, releasing your left knee down on the ground again. Now the toes and lightly set the feet together and folding in towards your knees and take a breath in as we unroll through the spine, gazing up to your thumbs, breathing out, hands coming back in towards your heart. Let's breathe in, raising both arms. As you breathe out, let's dive the body on forwards, breathing in left leg, stepping back, pushing to the left hand and raise the right hand up. Just again, really activate that back leg. Take some long, deep breaths in through your nose, out through your nose. And then let's turn and open your front foot, go to the outside edge of your back foot if you can. Lean your knee slightly out to the right. And then coming all the way back round. Letting your knee back down upon the floor. And let's just come up through into a little bit of a deeper hip flexor stretch. Just raising your arms straight up at this point. And now letting your arms down, moving off, coming into calf and hamstring stretch. And just moving the arms backwards and balancing on the heel if you can. Okay, pause. Put your fingers down against the floor if you need. Take the feet a little bit wider. Now bring your right arm across the front edge of your 
your mat. Left fingertips down to the floor. Take a deep breath in, come up. And as you breathe out, glancing over your left shoulder. So you might find your left foot with your gaze. You might find both feet. And then gently move it back around. Let's change sides. So fingertips to the floor. Deep breath in, coming on up. As you breathe out, glancing over your shoulder. Trying to relax your legs, relax your hips, your shoulders, your back.
bending into your right knee. Let's clasp the fingers back behind you and let your arms gently hang up and over into your humble warrior. out your right 
right arm, taking a hold of your right foot, and letting your left arm counterbalance you, and opening up the shoulder and the quad stretch as you take maybe the legs slightly back of your body. Slowly up to standing if you've got the balance today. 
extend that leg up high towards the ceiling again. And now with a big stride through, step into the top of your mat between your hands. And let's bring the back leg in half of your stride. Check your heels are online here. Bring your hands back behind you, either for a backwards prayer with your thumbs on top, or you're holding onto your elbows. And again, either hanging out at halfway, moving your heart towards your knee, or taking your chin towards your shin. Either way, enjoy that hamstring stretch. Shoulders relax. Now let's today step out 
further if you can, breathing in, and then breathing out to engage with your core, and sit slowly back on up. Deep breath in. As you go back, you're doing your best to try and work the lower back towards an imprint. Breathing in, and then breathing out as we slowly draw the body back on up and sit the body up tall. Again, deep breath in. As you breathe out, slowly working your body, carefully back and down. Breathing in. And as you breathe out, imprinting the spine and heaving the body up nice and tall again. Deep breath in. As you breathe out, let's lower the body carefully back. Breathing in. Breathe out to the left. Let's position the body across to the right. Breathe. 
breathing in to stay, and then breathing out slowly, lowering back down to the ground. Breathing in on the chin, breathing out, let's position the body across to the left. Breathing in, breathing out, engaging the core as you go. And if you want to make this a little bit harder, pick the feet up off the ground and point your toes. Breathing in, nodding the chin. Breathing out, positioning your body across to the right. Breathing in, and breathing out, engaging with the core as you lower. Breathing in, nodding the chin. Breathing out, positioning your body across to the left. Breathing in to stay. Breathing out, engaging the core as you lower. Breathing in, nodding the chin. Breathing out to position your body across to the right. Breathing in, breathing out, engaging the core as you lower. Breathing in, off the chin, and breathing out, positioning your core body across to the left. Breathing in, and breathing out, slowly lowering back down. Now, if you don't already, bring your feet up for me, and now let's bring the soles of your feet together. As you extend your legs away from your body now, breathing out and pushing away through your toes, and then breathing in the knees come down nice and wide. Breathing out, now extending away so the feet sit side by side. As you bring your knees down, the knees come nice and wide. Breathing out to extend, breathing in. Now if you can, keeping a neutral back, keeping a little bit of a gap between the lower back and the floor. If you feel stronger, let's raise the upper body. Breathing out to press away. And breathing in as you lower. Again, breathing out to press away. And breathing in as you lower. And if you feel okay with having an unsupported neck, bring your arms down by your side. Keep the head lifted if you can. As you circle your arms around, your legs go away at the same time, and then coming all the way back down. Breathing out, press the arms and legs away, breathing in to draw back down. Breathing out, press away, breathing in to draw down. Again, breathing out, press away, breathing in to draw down. Again, breathing out to extend, Breathing in to draw down. Let's have two more there. Breathing out, pushing away. And breathing in and down. One more time. And then breathing. Lowering your head, neck, and shoulders. Okay, last little posture now. Coming up into shoulder bridge. So if you draw your heels in for touching distance. Have your feet parallel, so try not to have a, a turnover. Take a deep breath in, and now as you breathe out, imprint the lower back, feel the spine away from the ground, travel up onto your upper back, breathing in and stay, and now as you breathe out, engage your core and lower your back down, vertebrae after vertebrae, breathing in, as you breathe out, imprint the spine, feel the back away from the ground, come on up onto your shoulders, Breathing in at the top, and then breathing out to lower your back down. If you can, do this without clenching your buttocks too much. So deep breath in, breathing out to ripple away, engage the core center, lift your hips. Breathing in, and then breathing out as you lower, working through the core into an imprint and back to neutral. Breathing in. Breathing out to ripple your back away from the ground. Use your core, lift your hips, relax your bottoms. Breathing in, and then breathing out, lowering your back down, imprinting, and all the way back to neutral. Breathing in, and breathing out, just draw up and away from the ground, up onto your shoulders. Breathing in, and then breathing out as you lower, into an imprint and back out to neutral. One more time, deep breath in. Breathing out, let's ripple up and away from the ground with the hips. Breathing in. And then breathing out as you lower, vertebrae by vertebrae. And relaxing it down. Okay, let's just straighten out your left leg. Hold your right knee in towards you. And then gently, if you can, bring your right knee across your body. Take your right hand out to the side. And now turn your gaze 
Flexing your legs. Just bring the hands all the way back behind. Rolling open the shoulders and the chest. And then gently tucking the head in.